Hello and thank you for watching another Extreme PDA video. Um, this one is going to be about the cigarette lighter auto mount. And this is going to be an instructional video on how to assemble the mount and actually install it in your car. So the first part we see here we have two pieces. We have the actual mount part which is a flexible gooseneck. It's about nine inches long. It can be positioned into any position you want bent this way and that way. Second part we have is the holder which actually holds your phone. And you can see by the holder it has two side arms. The side arms are cushioned. It has two positionable foot posts. These are also cushioned. It has a quick release side arm mechanism there and the actual connection part on the back. <clears throat> So the holder being like this, you would pop open the, uh, the arms and take your phone. I'm using the BlackBerry 8530 for this demonstration. It's a dummy phone, it's not a real phone. And you'd put your phone in, give it a squeeze, and your phone is in there and it's not going to come out of there until you press the quick release and take your phone out. Second part we have the mount. And as you can see, the top is a swivel ball mount, which can be rotated 360 degrees. It can be tightened at any position. You can also use the side wing nut here and position it either way this way. Also once the, once the uh, holder is on there, this part can be turned. The whole head can be turned, as you can see there. So this is by far one of the most positionable mounts that we have available. This part here is the part that would actually go into the cigarette lighter. You put it into the port, tighten it down, and it actually expands this part inside the cigarette lighter, which actually holds it in place. You loosen it up before the install, and then tighten it up when it's actually in there. This part here goes right into the back of the holder. Snap it right into place, and you're ready to go. You get into the position you want, tighten down the back, and like I told you, it can be rotated 360 degrees either way. If you have one of the new HTC phones, I'll use the HTC Hero, and you're using the navigational software, and you want to look at it in, in landscape mode, you can do that easily in landscape mode or in portrait mode. Again, pop it open, comes right out. Now we're going to take this out to the car and we're going to show you how to actually install it in your cigarette lighter port. Okay, now we're going to show you the uh, installation of the cigarette lighter mount in the actual cigarette lighter port. As you can see here, I've got my cigarette lighter port. And I want to show you here what's going to happen. Once the portion here is inserted into the cigarette lighter and you tighten it, What's going to happen is this part is expanding. It's getting bigger as you tighten down. And what that does is actually tighten, tighten it inside of the port. This is a uh, rubbery kind of material, so it's not going to be like you know hard plastic against the metal. But you must make sure that it's completely, completely loosened and down to the thinnest before you actually get it into the, uh, into the, into the port. So we're going to put it in there. And you can see that you know it's got a lot of play there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tighten it and it is going to expand out try to get it as tight as possible in my truck it's kind of hard I've got a bad position on here but it's fully in there now uh, my cigarette lighter port is a little bit loose I've, I've, I've taken, taken it out and installed it again so I mustn't have tightened it on completely but as you can see this is not going to go anywhere. It's not going to come out. It's not going to accidentally fall on the floor or anything like that. It's in there. Okay. Next part, what you want to do, if you can see this, is we're going to attach the holder to the mount. So we're going to put it on there, get it into place. And from this point, you're going to position that mount any way you want to. And best position for me is to get it away from my 
actual uh, steering wheel. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to utilize the wing nut a little bit. Put it over to me. And as you can see there, I've got a perfect, perfect viewing position. And I would pop it open. I'd place my phone in there. And you are good to go. That is a very nice installation for a car. Um, if you don't want to stick anything to your windshield, you have limited, um, or you know the vents are too small, or you you want if you have a console cigarette lighter port that may make it easier for you from down on the floor. But once that's in there, it's solid, and I can show you that it will rotate into a horizontal position. You can angle it up, you can angle it down, any position you want totally customizable to what you need and I'm now going to remove it take it out of there and what I'm going to have to do is loosen it at the cigarette lighter part here and it comes right back out and this can be moved easily from one car to another and it makes a perfect phone a car installation for any kind of smartphone fits almost any size smartphone and like I said horizontal for today's smartphones that go into the horizontal position or vertical position for navigational purposes so I'd like to thank you for watching our video um, we will have more installation videos of more of our car mounts so watch out for those and thank you for making your purchase at extreme PDA thanks again bye